Hi, today we're at uh, Northwest State Community College. We wanted to come out and show how they use the electric wheelbarrow, and uh, it's at electricwheelbarrows.com where you'll find it. They bought a chassis only to start with, and they modified it by putting a uh, flatbed on it. Uh, we have the flatbeds available. However, they put their own flatbed, native oak, and they use the turf tires for the quietness of it. It's something that, uh, one of the first ones that we sold a number of years ago, and I think it's been very interesting uh, because they have used it every day, and I think they just seem to like it. So, Tim, why don't you tell them what you do with it? Because okay. you know a lot more than I do. No, no, we use this every day and several times a day. We're out in a remote facility and our college here, so we've got to haul books, uh, UPS, whatever comes in from our shipping department, from our receiving department, we take it into the school and essentially we take it from our receiving and we'll load it and we'll take it right into the classrooms, into the mail rooms, wherever, right with the students and it's quiet, it's safe, we've never had any incidents, it goes through the electric doors, fine. We we love it. I mean it's just What kind of weight do you haul with that, Tim? You know, a load like this might be two or three hundred pounds, but we get books from our bookstore that we can load this up. We've, we've had a thousand pounds of books. We get library books, we get books at the bookstore, we just load it up and um, it doesn't miss a lick. It just, and to push that across this parking lot like we used to is just inhuman to do something like that. <laughs> so yeah. so they, it's really yeah. saved us time and money. And it don't bother classrooms or anything as you're going through You can't hall. hear it. You cannot hear it when it's going through. And, uh, everybody wants to borrow, but we kind of hang on to it ourselves. So. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate your, your yep. testimony here today. So.